Understanding UK's melody, the regional accents. Hello everyone. Today, we're diving deep into the heart of the UK to explore and understand the diverse and intriguing regional accents. By the end of this video, you'll be able to identify some key accents from across the United Kingdom. Let's get started. In any language, accents offer a glimpse into a region's history, culture, and identity. Accents aren't just about pronunciation. They carry with them stories of migration, historical events, and cultural interactions. In the UK, the richness of accents is particularly notable given its compact size. Before we dive into accents, let's quickly brush up on our geography. The UK comprises four countries. England, the largest in terms of area and population. Scotland, north of England. Wales, to the west of England. Northern Ireland, shares its island with the Republic of Ireland. Each of these countries, and even regions within them, boasts its unique accent. 1. Cockney. Originating from East London, it's one of the most famous accents, known for the rhyming slang. 2. Estuary English, a mix between London and Southeastern accents. Celebrities like David Beckham have popularized this accent. 3. West Country. Think of the pirate accent. That's the West Country accent from areas like Cornwall and Devon. 4. Brummy, from Birmingham. Often considered very distinctive and unlike accents from neighboring regions. 5. Scouse, from Liverpool. This accent has musical intonations and is often associated with the Beatles. 6. Mancunian, from Manchester, softer than Scouse but equally unique. 7. Geordie, from Newcastle, another highly distinct accent which stands out, even within the UK. 8. Welsh, from Wales, melodious and sings Sanji and nature. 9. Yorkshire, as the name suggests, from Yorkshire. Known for its flat vowels. 10. Glaswegian, from Glasgow, Scotland, often considered strong and very recognizable. 11. Belfast, from Northern Ireland, has influences from both the Irish accent and other UK accents. It's important to note that each of these regions might have multiple sub-accents, and variations exist even within small areas. These are broad categories to get you started. One thing to remember is that no accent is better or worse than another. Accents are a badge of one's heritage and background. As learners, it's crucial to be receptive and respectful, and most importantly, enjoy the variety and history they bring to the language. We've taken a whirlwind tour of the UK's accents today. I hope this video has helped you appreciate the diversity and richness of the English language as spoken across the UK. Keep listening, keep practicing, and remember to embrace the diversity of the language. Until next time, happy learning!